Hello everyone, I am Kat. Welcome to my channel, You Have Arrived. For today's video, I have a really fun curl refresh and a sunset inspired makeup look. That's right, we got some curls, we got some makeup. So if you would like to see how I accomplish both, then stick around with me and keep watching. And if you do enjoy this video, please hit that like button. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. All right, as you can see, we're starting with the curls. I split them a half up and half down. I'm gonna start refreshing with a little light mist of water, kind of using prayer hands or just kind of like running the water over the curls and a slight scrunch. And then I'm gonna use that same technique to apply Riso's Curls re Refresh and Detangle Mist. Once I've applied the water and the mist all over my curls, I'm then gonna pick up my Sazzy Band to keep the curls back out of my way so I can continue with the makeup look as my curls start to air dry. Off camera, went ahead and primed my eyelids. Now they're ready for a base. So I'm using some jumbo eye pencils, a gold shade for the inner portion, and a beautiful rust shade for the mid to outer V. I'm gonna blend those out with some pads on my fingers, and then picking up a nice light brown shade, I'm gonna work on the crease in the outer V. Once those are nice and blended, I'm gonna pick up a gorgeous red shimmer shadow. I'm gonna keep packing that on so it's nice and bold and bright and vibrant. And then once again, picking up that light brown shade and blending out the crease and outer V. For the inner portion, we're gonna use a gorgeous golden like yellow shade and I'm gonna work it to the whole inner portion of my eye and then blend out with a clean brush. For the mid to outer third for the lower lash line, I'm using a white jumbo pencil and then on top of that, I'm gonna pack a nice orange shadow. Once that's packed, I'm gonna pick up that light brown shade again, blend out the edges. We're quickly gonna catch up the other eye and then off camera, add some brows. Today I chose a brown liquid eyeliner. I typically love to use black for my eyeliners, but today I was feeling crazy. I went with some brown and I'm so glad that I did. This brown shade just absolutely complements this eye look. And for this look today, I'm using about a mid wing. And also if you guys would love to see more in-depth video of me doing some smaller mid to large like cat eye wings, let me know, I'd love to share. All right, now it's time to catch up the other eye. After adding a liner to my lower waterline and some lashes, it's time to set my face. So here we go, quick set, quick fan out, and then my favorite part after adding my setting mist is to add highlight. So I'm gonna pick up a brush first and I'm going to add the highlight to the inner corner of my eye and then the brow bone. I'm also gonna bring the highlight to the bridge of my nose, the tip of my nose, and of course, sexy, sexy time, the Cupid's bow, and my cheekbones as well. Jumping down to my lips, I'm gonna use two liquid lipsticks today. So reaching for that darker shade first, I'm gonna apply it and then with the lighter shade, I'm gonna keep that into the inner portion of the lower and upper lip. Once that is nice and blended, I'm gonna pick up a gorgeous highlight, the one we used earlier, and I'm gonna dab it right on the middle of my lower lip, blot my lips together, give myself a quick little shimmy little shake and then jumping up to my curls. So we gotta finish this refresh. Removing that Zazzy band, I'm then gonna pick up some hair and body oil from That's That Magic. This is my favorite, it smells amazing. I will link it down below. If you're interested, check it out. So I'm gonna give a quick little separation of my curls and then I'm gonna pick up my Satin Scrunchie. This is from Satin Scrunchie Company. A Little more uh, hair and body oil from That's That Magic. Swoop these curls up nice and high. I'm gonna wrap them up in a nice high pineapple. So I'm gonna pull them through once, one loop, pull it through and done. Give these curls a nice little fluff, a little shake, and that is it, everybody. The look is complete. I hope that all of you guys really enjoyed today's video and all of my makeup lovers and my curl friends. I hope you guys come back next week and join me for another video. Take care.
You're cut off. You're done. You're dead to me. You're done. I don't know why he keeps doing that. Okay. Off you go. Smile! Smile! It's not a picture, honey. Record! It's already recording. <laughs> why do you make me look foolish? You did all that on your own! <laughs> Thank you.